हेलो एवरीवन दिस इज रजनीश दुबे एंड टुडे आई एम गोइंग टू एक्सप्लेन योर विस्टाज फर्स्ट लेसन ऑफ क्लास ट्वेल्थ इंग्लिश स्कोर द नेम ऑफ दिस लेसन इज द थर्ड लेवल रिटर्न बाय जैक फिने सो स्टूडेंट्स थ्रू दिस वीडियो I am going to cover the whole content of your this lesson like as about the author theme of this lesson detailed and short summary of your this lesson and line by line explanation of your textbook hard word and its meaning many more things so finally you have need to watch this video till to end because this is going to be very helpful for class 12 cbsc board students so in this lesson there are three main protagonist character three main characters first one charlie charlie is the protagonist character and this whole story is be round up with charlie and second character is loisha loisha is the wife of charlie and the third character is sam winner Sam Winner is the friend of Charlie. Students, this is very complex story. So you have need to be with me and listen each and every content of this story. Actually, our protagonist Charlie wants to meet his wife. He was been hurry to reach there. Then he took. train to reach there so for this he reached at to grand central station this station is very big and when he reached there then he found himself at the third level actually students there are only two levels but according to the opinion of charlie there are three levels he was at the third level this is not possible but according to the thinking of charlie this is possible actually the olden time of 1894 always be running all the things about the attire of the people about the newspaper like as the world all the things always be running in his mind because he was a stamp collector so according to his job and according to his thinking his mind was be running in the old age days of 1894 so that olden time things is appear in front him in the reality so he was at the third level but there are only two levels so try to understand what what is the difference between the mind of common people and Charlie's mind. So, students, I am going to explain your this first page. Here, the narration is in the form of mock serious manner. The president of the New York Central and the New York, the New Haven and Hartford railroads, will swear on a stack of timetables that there are only two levels at Grand Central Station. but according to charlie there are three levels charlie had been on the third level he talked to his friend sam winner about it he dismissed it as a walking dream fulfillment he said the narrator was unhappy the narrator's wife luisa means narrator is here or charlie 
Charles' wife Louisa was very sad. Charles' sarcastic friend Sam told all the things to his wife Louisa. He said more about the modern world was full of insecurity, fear, war and worry. The narrator just wanted to escape. His friends also agreed. They thought that his habit of storm collecting was a temporary refuge from reality. Students, Charlie was 31 years old. He was an ordinary person. One night, he wanted to get up down to his home to meet his wife Louisa. So he turned into Grand Central Station from Vanderbilt Avenue. He went down the steps to the first level. But where one can take trains like the 20th century. Then he walked down another flight upstairs to the second level. From second level, suburban trains left from. Then he dug into an arc doorway and heading for the subway and he got lost. Charlie said here, according to his opinion, the Grand Central Station is growing like a tree, pushing out of corridors and staircase like roots. Then, near the corridor, when he was begin angling left from the downwards, he thought that he was wrong, but he kept on walking. He heard the empty sound of only his own footsteps that means there was no anyone. He didn't pass anyone. Then the tunnel turned sharp left. He went down a short flight of stairs and came out on the third level. Finally, he came out on the, on the third level at Grand Central Station. For a moment, he thought he was back on the second level. But the room he saw was smaller. There were favor ticket windows and train gates. Moreover, the information booth in the center was wooden and old looking. So he was assured that he was at the third level. That man was in the booth worth wore a green eye set and long black sleeve protector. The open flame of gas lights were dim and flickering. There were brass speed tones on the floor. There was a glint of light across the stairs. That means at the third level, he saw many different things from the second level. Now students, finally Charlie was at the third level. Then he saw there different types of things related to the olden time. Then he saw a man pulled a gold watch from his waist pocket. Pocket. The man snapped open the cover. He glanced at his watch and frowned. He wore a derby hat and a black four-button suit with teeny lapels. He had a big black moustache. Then Charles looked around. He saw that everyone in the station was dressed like 1890 century. A woman walked in through the train gates. She wore a leg of mutton slips and skirt to the top of her high button suit. Then he also saw a very small courier and Ives locomotive with a funnel shaped stack. Then Charlie knew that he was back in the 1890s. He walked over the news boy and glanced at the stack of papers. At his feet, it was the world. There was newspaper. Its name is the world. The lead story in the world said something about the president 
of clever land he knew that the word had not been published for years from the files of the public library he came to know the date that date was june 11 1894 then charlie turned towards the ticket window and he wanted two tickets to gilsburg illinois one was to be for himself and other was for his beloved wife louisa two tickets to gilsburg for this he said to the ticket clerk then clerk calculated the fare then he glanced at charlie's face had bent charlie counted out the, the money the clerk stared at charlie and refused to escape the bill saying that money charlie glanced at the cash drawer beside him the money was old style bills and he has the modern money he can't give these money to the color because his money is not be matched in 1890s so charlie turned away and got out first because he did not want to go to jail next day charlie drew 300 dollars out of the bank he went to the coin dealers shop to buy old money his 300 dollars bought less than 200 in old style he wanted to go back to the ticket counter on the third level to buy two tickets but he has never again found the corridor that led to the third level at grand central station anymore that means when again he reached there at the grand central station then he never found the third level he returned back from there and told all his story to his friend charles and his wife luisa when luisa listened this then she was very quiet she was too worried she didn't want him to look for the third level anymore after a while charlie stopped it he went back to stamp collecting but now both of them were looking every weekend because they had proof that the third level was still there his friend sam winner had disappeared nobody knew where he had gone but charlie suspected that he had gone to the gilsburg because he used to tell sam about the place and he said that he liked the sound of the place then he go to the bank near the bank and find out the information about uh, his friend sam then he found the information from the bank actually sam just dealt 800 dollars in the old end money and he wants to go gilsburg and start his grains business then students one night charlie was fussing with his stamp collection then suddenly he found a first day cover dated july 18 1994 there was a stamp of 6 cent its color is dark brown and on that the picture of president garfield there was a paper inside it was a letter written from gilsburg illinois and on this letter dated july 18 1894 and this letter is addressed to charlie by sam 
here through this letter sam wants to address to charlie that he had found the third level and had been at gelsberg for two weeks at that time he was down the street at the dailies someone was playing piano and people were all out of front porch they were singing he was invited over for lemonade then sam asked charlie and luisa to come there he asked them to keep looking till they found the third level he assured them that it was worth it and after reading this paper charlie went to the bank and constable then he found out the information about sam actually sam had bought 800 dollars worth on old style currency that could set him up in a hay feed and green beans according to opinion of charlie that grand central station has three levels but this is not correct there are only two levels this is the mind of charlie according to his thinking he is saying that there are three levels because he always been thinking about the olden time so for this that third level is appear in front of him that to uh, olden days 80 90s time see was appearing there but again when he reached again to find the third level then he never found so finally he has the information about this he has the sense about this there are only two levels he was in confusion so by this way thank you to so, such kind of care and watching my video i am giving the further related question answers of your this lesson so be pen down all the things best of luck